If you're considering insurance but worried about the impact of your pregnancy on your ability to get cover, check out this video as I walk you through the key terminology and things you need to bear in mind when applying for insurance and also give you the peace of mind to know that right up to the date that you start your maternity leave, you're entitled to the same levels of cover. Okay, the next question is how does pregnancy impact your ability to get cover? So, um, Typically, insurance isn't something that we talk about every single day, unless you're me. Um, most people, um, there comes a time when it becomes important to consider uh, providing for people that aren't you. And pregnancy is one of those times that you start to think about things um, from a different perspective. Now, if you're already and you're a full-time mum and you're not at work, then there's absolutely no change between being pregnant and you'll be assessed in exactly the same way. But if you're a mum who's at work currently and planning on going on maternity leave, then in terms of applications for insurance, you can apply for insurance cover right up to the day that you go on maternity leave. Now, any impact on applications that you do come down to a couple of key things. The first thing that they wanna know is, are you gonna be going back to work in a similar or same role? And are you gonna be going back to work to the similar or same hours. And they're the big ones that the insurance companies will wanna know before being able to offer you cover um, for you, knowing that you're gonna be going on to maternity leave. Now, the big one here is that we don't have a crystal ball. We don't know what life's gonna throw at us. We have every intention of going back to work and you might change your mind and wanna stay at home for a bit longer. Um, you might wanna go back to reduced hours, all those sorts of things. All the insurance company is asking for is your intention here. So if your intention is to do that, then you are absolutely entitled to the same amount of insurance um, that you would have been pre-maternity leave. Um, but you will also notice a couple of things here. The closer you get to your, uh, to your due date, um, you'll see it change with your, your medical tests. So there could be some things that come back here that are different to what you'd expect. Bear in mind that the insurance companies are well aware of the fact that there's changes um, whilst you are going through pregnancy and they're well aware of what that would look like on the body and they'll assess you fairly when it comes to that too. And the, the big misconception that we get about insurance companies is that they want to decline your application and that's just not the case. The insurance companies are in this to make sure that they offer fair assessments and they are well aware of the things that are, are going on for you at the same time too. Hey there, it's Biggs. Thanks for checking out the video. If you like these videos and you want to see more, we bring out a new video around the insurance topic every weekday. So hit that subscribe button next to me. Be notified when we release these videos. We love your support. We're here to build the community, community and we want to bring you more videos. Thanks again for tuning in. I'll chat to you soon.